News point number one. News point number two. GameIndustry.biz reports that there's a patent for a new controller device by Sony, which they hinted at at their, their release. I believe they said that they're uh, working on new peripherals, maybe, by Sony uh, for their new VR controllers. And the patent shows a wand-like apparatus, uh, specifically it mentions adaptive triggers and haptic feedback, much like the DualSense. This is good news. Did you, look at, did, did you see it? I, did saw, you see the I didn't look, look, but I saw diagrams from a distance, like the small thumbnail, but... Dude, I'll take anything over the move controllers. Yeah. I mean, honestly, what it looks like is a mix between maybe the move controller and like uh, the those controllers for the the Oculus, which are they're kind of like, yeah, they're like you grip it. But it's got like the strap that goes around your hand, yeah, I've you know, used and them. you use like your thumb and there's like a trigger, right? So, um, and you probably got one in each hand and you kind of wave them around. Do Haptic feedback would be kind of cool on those too, for sure. Yeah. Like the, the article I was reading mentioned something about how you could use the adaptive triggers to like make it in the haptic feedback to like make it give you some feedback as far as like if you're picking something up, like it's hard to grab it because it's heavy or like whatever. Like it could be, could be interesting. I mean, I've, often on this show talked about how like I am not like I am impressed by the haptic feedback in the dual sense, but I don't necessarily love it when I'm playing a lot of games. Right. Like I think that in the VR space, this is something, this is a place where it could really shine because it's all about immersion, right? Everything is about immersion and making you feel like you're in the game. Right. So if they can use these, this haptic feedback on these little controller sticks that they've got coming, um, you know, to be fair, it, it, I put down wand like, but it basically what it looks like is imagine if you took a pistol and then just took like the barrel off of it. Right. So it was just like the grip part. That's mm-hmm. what it looks like. I heard rumors so, too that there was a patent for the VR. Sony had passed some patents where like it was actually like a regular controller that would like would pull apart. Did you see anything like that in the diagram? I, where it would connect or anything? I've heard some rumblings about that no pun intended but i uh i didn't actually see the any articles about it um but i didn't really look that hard that's fine but i think that that would be something that would be interesting you know to have like a controller that you can kind of pull apart Break and away. use in both hands and then so that way you could use it as a controller mm-hmm. or you could use it as separate sticks for doing vr something type stuff. modular that could turn into like even like something where we could use like a gun you know what I mean? Like, like I would like to have, man, because I, I, I never used the, man, what was the PlayStation VR gun called? I don't even remember. The aim controller. I never used the aim controller, but I love Dude, the idea fucked, of it. They fucked up so bad. Like, the aim controller was awesome, and from what I understand, it was really good. Impossible to get but now, they, right? They made it for that game Farpoint. You remember the game Farpoint? Yeah, it just I think came out actually, free last week, this past, right. this month. This month it's free. So they made it for Farpoint. And then after that game came out, they just stopped making them. And now they're impossible to find. So I hope they they come out with like a new version or like a cradle for the new controllers that you can mm-hmm. put them in to kind of make it look like a gun, right? Something like that for the new version of VR because from what I understand, the aim controller really made that game work well. Farpoint is what I'm talking about. Yeah. Apparently it worked really great. Yeah. So, yeah. Well, hey. Uh,